Hello, my name is Mel, and if you didn't know, I shaved off all my hair because I had alopecia. Today I thought I'd do a fun video of explaining some of the benefits of being bald. This is to help fellow alopecians out, just people interested in general, what it's like to be bald and some of the benefits, because some people like to look at the negatives of things, so I'm going to tell you some of the benefits of things. Actually, not only am I going to tell you some of the benefits of things, someone reached out to me. He has a very large following on TikTok. His name is Nico. He is brilliant. He's from America. And we're going to explain some of the benefits of being bald, especially now because it is actually Alopecia Awareness Month. And stick around to the end because we both have a very special message. Here's some of the benefits of being bald by Mel and Nico. Um, Houston, Texas. So you might be wondering, what exactly are the benefits of being bald? Well, I never have to shave, I never have to comb my hair, I never have to use shampoo, and most importantly, I never have to worry about blow drying my hair. I guess one of the things I really like doing is just taking it off and be like, I'm bald! I just like shocking people, I guess. <laughs> Women know this, but it's just so nice not to have to allocate days for your hair wash, greasy one day after the second day, etc, etc. So it's just so nice not having to wash and condition my hair every other day, worrying about it being greasy on one day, you know what I mean? Because my hair was super greasy, because, you know, Spanish. Also, because I'm bald, I'm actually my own table. I love just grabbing my hat and just going, not having to worry about brushing my hair because it was an absolute nightmare. And whenever I get hungry... I'm my own plate. Another big benefit is I can take on many a identity. <laughs> I call this look the demand in speaking to your manager look. I also call this look your understaffness is not an excuse for me because I am entitled. I also call this look I click my fingers at restaurants. <laughs> I'm Karen. I'm basically I'm Karen. I'm Karen. Um, or I'm a, a massive massive emo. I call this look Ice coffee is basically my whole personality. Um, I also call this look, um, I get very drunk at frat parties. Look, I think I'm totally embarrassing myself. What is this? What is this? 2012 Shane Dawson? Bloody hell. I call this look, very attractive man look. Actually, no, actually, this is what I look like, actually, if I didn't m maintain myself because uh, I'm quite hairy everywhere else, I'm not going to lie. So I really wanted to get a video recording of me and Nico speaking at the end, but we couldn't legally screen record it, so we had to do it like this. Enjoy. Okay, I'm recording now. I can see the delay now too, oh my goodness. Look how perfect your round egg head is. I'm, it's I'm such an egg. There, that's our comparison right there. Well, I've took my hat off in solidation for you as well. We here. are round. Squat. Egg squat. what? 2020? This guy is awesome. This is Nico. He has a special message. That's why I said to wait till the end and so we can hang out together. <laughs> oh, first selfie. Yeah. I'll say like he's He's done an amazing job like reaching out to me and many other young people with alopecia. Please explain to us, well first of all, what, what kind of alopecia do you have? You have the rarest one, don't you? I am the, the third evolution. I pretend that alopecia is like Pokemon. You know, you got three evolutions. The first stage is Ariata, Totalis, and Universalis. So I'm Universalis, which means I'm an egg literally everywhere. Wow. So it's great. Your special announcement, please, what you're doing to help with Alopecia Awareness Month. Go, go, yeah. go. All right, all right. So we got two things. So the National Alopecia Ariata Foundation is one of my sponsors. So the best way, absolute best way that you can help out is by just donating. And I'm sure that Mel will drop a nice link to where you can do that. And literally like what, one buck? Two bucks, three bucks, five bucks, whatever you got helps to go towards a cure for alopecia, helps people like me or Mel get wigs more affordably. Do it. Just do it. Every it's little help. So much. 
that little bit is going to make the, all the difference in the world. And it takes you like two minutes. Here's another way you can help if you got alopecia. They're having a video competition. It's called the Unmask Alopecia Awareness Month competition. You make a video of your favorite masked hero. It could be a real masked hero, or it can be your kid who has an inspiring journey with alopecia, or your parent who's helped you so much wearing a mask, or a doctor who works long hours and is just so brilliant in what they do, and you respect them a whole bunch. You make the video, be as creative as you want. It only takes like 15 to 20 seconds. I submitted a about a 10 second video of me talking about how my girlfriend was my favorite masked hero, how she inspires me every day. So relationships can't relate yeah i'm gonna leave all the links to that in the description below so everything he's talked about um i will leave all the links he will send them and yeah i appreciate you doing this video with me and yeah raising awareness thanks doing... for having me here no Got problem that texas collaboration yeah <laughs> you do british now I'm, I'm not i'm not a proper chap i've got i've got coffee here I'm... okay see you later guys thanks so much for watching as per usual bye, bye. Thank <laughs> you.